as a young Christian, I was still tied to the old man code. I was still struggling with my identity. I was still trying to make sense of what, how you can be a Christian and be a man at the same time. As a matter of fact, a guy wrote a book about that that gives us a lot of insight into why our prayerlessness is probably the word that you would put over the church today. And you know, there's a word called Ichabod in the scripture. It means God is not here. One person put it this way. You've heard me say this before. The Holy Spirit's left the church and we don't even know it. Well, if he has, and I think that's true for a lot of churches. And if you're not praying, you don't know it. People that are praying are connected. Intimacy with God is a whole point of prayer. Getting to know God's heart, getting to know God. If there was ever a day, if there was ever a time when we need men of God who also, and I'm not sure we can really say we're men of God if we're not men of prayer, growing in prayer, learning to pray. God, Lord, teach us to pray. When's the last time you asked God, teach me to pray? Because here's what happens in prayer. When you get in prayer, you're not chucking and jiving anymore. I mean, there's a lot of religious prayers. The Pharisees prayed a lot of religious prayers. They'd get on the corner and they'd pray out loud so they could be noticed. Jesus said, don't pray like that. Go in your closet. And he who sees you in your closet will reward you in secret. But when we pray, people get to hear our hearts. Because when we pray, we pray in ways that we don't talk. You know how much grief and pain you're carrying right now that could be relieved that quick? Just turning to the Lord in prayer and just saying, God, I need your help. And if you're hesitating here on me, if you're waiting to help me, then I know you're teaching me to persevere and have endurance and faith. But I just need you to know I need your peace. You said, my peace I give you, my peace I leave with you. Not as the world gives do I give to you. So if you don't want peace, if you don't want a sense of hope, if you don't want to feel like I'm secure, if you want to be fearful and if you want to be down and you want to be angry and you want to be bitter, you can be. You can be either one. You can be whichever you want. But if you want the peace that surpasses understanding... If you want the joy, 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 the Lord, Lord, Lord all the time, you can't have it. Well, that's not true. You can't have happiness all the time. You can always have the joy of the Lord. Are you in or out? Yeah. I believe you are. It was a good one. Let's, pray, let's, <laughs> let's stack hands on that. If you like this message and you'd like to see the full sermon, you can find it on our Vimeo channel. Link is in the description. A Minister to Men is an online ministry of Influencers West. You can find us on Facebook, Twitter, or go to our website to sign up for our weekly podcast. If you'd like to see more M2M short videos like this, click on any of the video thumbnails to see more. And to be notified when a new M2M video is up, why not subscribe? We upload new videos every Tuesdays and Thursdays. Thank you for watching, and God bless you.